Be music night by Kenneth Patcher. Be music night that her sleep may go, where angels have their pale, tall choirs. Be a hand to see that her dreams may watch, that guides when touching the green flesh of the world. Be a voice, sky, that her beauties may be counted, and the stars will tilt their quiet faces into the mirror of her loveliness. Be a road, earth, that her walking may take thee. Where the towns of heaven lift their breathing spires, will be a world and a throne, God, that her living may find its weather, and the souls of ancient bells in a child's book shall lead her into thy wondrous house. Be music night by Kenneth Batchelor. Be music night that her sleep may go, where angels have their pale tall choirs. Be a hand see that her dreams may watch, that God's been touching the green flesh of the world. Be a voice sky, that her beauties may be counted, and the stars will tilt their quiet faces into the mirror of her loveliness. Be a road earth, that her walking may take thee, where the towns of heaven lift their breathing spires. Will be a world and a throne, God, that her living may find its weather, and the souls of ancient bells in a child's book shall lead her into thy wondrous house. I'm here with some mathematics talking about poetry. So, what's the name of the poem that you chose? Be music. And why did you choose it? I liked the ring to it, and it just is relaxing. I like singing. I see. Who wrote this poem? Kenneth Patchen. Have you heard of him before? No. <laughs> Did you feel an emotional connection with your poem? Kind of. It just, something about it drew me to want to recite the poem. So, I see. So, how did you feel when you were recording this poem and hearing your voice? Pretty good. It was kind of weird hearing my own voice, though. Just kind of freaks me out. Yeah. What was this poem about, basically? Like, what was the main theme or message of the poem trying to get across? I think the message was about going to heaven, mm -hmm. pretty much. So, like, the afterlife? Yeah. I see. That's interesting. <laughs> this... Is Samantha Mattis' interview for poetry. That's not. It's not? Okay. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> we have to go. Be Music Night by Kenneth Patchen. Be music night that her sleep may go, where angels have their pale tall choirs. Be a hand to see that her dreams may watch, thy guides when touching the green flesh of the world. Be a voice sky that her dreams may be, that her beauties may be counted, and the stars will tilt their quiet faces into the mirror of her loveliness. Yeah, it's not good. <laughs>